Well, a school bus driver in Traverse City has been arrested for criminal sexual conduct with a Traverse City Area Public School student. We're going to head over to My News 26's Remington Hernandez, who has more on the story. That's right, Jacob. The alleged misconduct happened while a TBAISD bus was taking students home on October 6th. That's when 66-year-old Larry Butler, a bus driver for Dean Transportation, is said to have touched a student inappropriately. The incident was caught on security cameras, and when both Dean and TBAISD found out, they called police. We were notified on October 6th around 10 p.m. at night, uh, and I believe that uh, Dean Transportation and TBAISD were also both notified that day of the allegation. And uh, after they were able to verify uh, some of the allegations, they contacted us immediately, and then we started our investigation. Now we're learning that this was not Butler's first time acting inappropriately. He was previously terminated from TCAPS over another undisclosed incident. Dean says that they were made aware of this, but claim a now former Human Resources employee didn't relay the information. Well, we did reach out to uh, the former employer, who turned out to be uh, Traverse City Area Public Schools, TCAPS, and uh, they uh, quickly responded to us uh, of this individual's uh, former work history. Unfortunately, on our end, the Dean Transportation HR assistant uh, missed an email mishandled an email which indicated uh, uh, the previous history. TBA ISD contracts with Dean for special education transportation in certain counties, and administrators were taken aback by these revelations. We were distraught. We were appalled. Parents uh, entrust their children to us to educate them and to keep them safe. And so there is a certain loss of trust um, between us and the community and parents and um, likewise a certain loss of trust between us and Dean Transportation. We understand that we, we have to do something about that. This is an adult responsibility and um, we're looking at all of those things. Dean Transportation CEO Kelly Dean says he was shocked and saddened and that his company has already taken steps to make their buses safer. What we're doing on all of our TBISD buses is adding an additional camera. It's going to be the third camera uh, in an already state-of-the-art system. Uh, we also are doing uh, regular random checks of, of videos on all vehicles throughout uh, the ISD. Also, as it relates to uh, reference checks, uh, we're going to a much higher level of, uh, of personal reference checks with former employees. Larry Butler is now facing three counts of criminal sexual conduct in the second degree. If convicted, he faces up to 15 years in prison for each count. In the studio, Remington Hernandez, My News 26.